Hello and welcome to my Fusion 360 tutorials. Today we are going to design a big pen. So let's start. Uh, we start with a cylinder, uh, with a sphere. Sorry. Select the plane and we do a sphere of 0.7. Then we have the ball tip for the pen. So let's call it ball. Big handle. Now you got to sketch around the ball. Then our tip, so we do uh, a circle here, a little bit bigger than the tip, and now we are going to draw a line about uh, in size about uh, 15. Now you have the, some kind of construction line, so we do about 80 milli 8 millimeters height then we do a tangent of in this circle here as you can see don't overpass it make it tangent be sure you have this symbol here now let's draw the inners of the tip so about um, about here Sorry. One point six. Okay. It's okay. So let's throw something fancy here. So is this will be the ink path? Let's trim out the the excess here, as you can see. We need to revolve this. So quick stop. Create, revolve, select the profile and the axis will be the red one. As you can see, we have the tip. Now that you have the tip, let's draw the tubing. For the tubing, we need to create a sketch here. Select this face. We, we need to project this circle and do an inner circle. We can do the outline from this to here an offset line about 0 0.8 it's okay now click if for extrusion select both sides two sides let's do the tubing inner a little bit be sure you select new body and out about 110 millimeters so this will be the tubing click ok now you you have the tubing here let's select tube let's rename to tube and this will be the tip let's rename to tip tip so you have a tubing at the tip we need to draw the ink for the ink we can use the same sketch turn on the sketch again hide the tubing and extrude the center part can extrude both two sides a little bit ink inside and inside the, the tip and we choose about a less more than about 10 millimeters so we choose 100 this will be the ink this will be the tubing so let's rename it as ink so you have the ink and we have the hinders of the pen let's apply some color so Click A for color. We have paint gloss applied to the ink. So we need metal, brass, no, it's not brass, it's a bronze, bronze patina. We apply it to the tip. The, oh, con could be the default one, this one, still. And uh, for the tubing, we need acrylic. So let's go to acrylic, plastic, transparent, acrylic. So drag over here, and now if you can see we have something. As you can see, we have the inside of the pen. So let's let's start the body. For the body, uh, we need to reference to this. So you create a new sketch. We need to grab this plane. Let's hide 
oh and uh, create a circle here sorry we need to grab the center sorry create the circle okay a little bit bigger here so let's hide the tip for now and select ID sketch too and select all the profile sorry make sure you select all click E for extrusion sorry oh, let's make uh, an angle of 25 or less 25 let's see if it, it's okay yes it's good now let's extrude this with uh, no angle so extrude the circle 130 a little bit bigger than the tip than the the body the the tubing so let's rename this as body body so we have a body but we need to create the holes uh, for the holes we need to subtract this to the tip so create a combine and select two bodies the tip can select the tip we can hide it again now we do a cut and keep the tools don't forget to put keep the tools now we have an extra body here we can click and remove sorry we can't remove it yet because we need to first draw a circle an extrusion cut so we are going to select this face to sketch and do a circle about this size it's too big let me do again yes now it's good let's extra cut the middle part until we reach the the other hole we extrude we remove from the tip so about you can pass a little bit no worries about that so it's getting hard to okay that will go now you have the hole we can remove the other body this this middle part here as you can see click remove now we have the the pen let's make it a polygon so you see you like you have to select this this face and create and select polygon circumscribe because we have to leave uh, like a, a chamfer here so we have to select like so okay let me see let's try again okay now let's extrude it select the profile all six let's see we do extrusion oh i'm sorry i click here again and profiles unselected okay let's drag uh, extend to all now you have the cuts click ok so the body is formed let's draw the tip the the cap for the the, the this part so uh, we this will call the body okay now let's do the tip we reference reference from this face so click circle 
we draw, we draw a circle click P for a projection draw another circle and this ring will be extruded to the inside so let's let's click extrude select the ring and extrude about six click new body and you add the inner part of the the, the cap let's create an angle negative one so it will be perfect for insertion so now we need to extrude click at the sketch and extrude these two parts a little bit and these so extrude select oh, 1 2 3 extrude 0 0.5 now we have some kind of, of filling here so we need to do uh, another sketch and select you can select any face let me see this one we do ellipse here let's select an ellipse be sure you select the alt part and your taste about there well now draw a line from here to here and trim these parts as you can see we can revolve it select the profile and select the axis that will be our red axis and we have the tip let's select joints for the join of the cup and we have the body I think I I join it uh, I join it join it somewhere I don't know where but I think I join it to the body no worries we need to go here and see where I extrude it no not this one here click edit and you will we select that new body I don't know why you joined it hmm it's okay why so new body here I don't know why it's joining. Mm, maybe. Oh, we need to hide this. Ah, now we have it. I forgot to hide the bodies, then it joined it automatically for contact. So, we need to add the appearance. Uh, let's select the plastic opaque this part and that's all we need we have the pen here all drying in less than 50 minutes so let's try to render it we need to apply the appearance acrylic to here you can select polycarbonate it's cool too so we have the pen a little, a little bulky but I don't I don't have the purpose to, to make measurements here it's just for exercising okay I hope you liked it and uh, please subscribe to my videos if you like it and uh, thumbs up thank you very much for your time I hope you learned something today bye bye until the next time